Am I about to break the internet with these never been worn Miami Cuban links that are now available on linksresale.com? High quality and the price is about to stress some Miami Cubans out. With that being said, let's get started. What's going on everyone? It's Brain Witch Koji Fine Jewelry, your personal jeweler. Now on one hand, we own Jacoji Fine Jewelry and I work for this company Monday through Wednesday. And on the other hand, we have our other company, Lynx Resale. They are both our companies. So I'm making this review for Lynx because we just added some fire Miami Cuban Lynx. I'm excited to share to you guys. Lynx Resale specializes in buying and selling secondhand jewelry, but we have never been worn items brand new from the factory that we are offering like this Miami Cuban link. I want to get that clarified. I feel like I have to, to start these reviews so you guys understand what's going on. Because I'm working for Jacoji today, I want to review the Jacoji Miami's versus these new domestic made Miami Cuban links to show you guys the difference. The big difference to me is one is from Italy, the ones from Jacoji are directly from Italy. They are more expensive because that is the case versus the domestic made ones that don't have the import tax on there. They aren't as costly to make. So on Lynx Resale, you're getting them cheaper price per gram. Just go compare the two. You'll see there's a significant price difference between the two, but how is the quality? Now let's get into this. On the left, we have the Lynx Resale Miami Cuban Link at four millimeters. This is an extremely popular size versus the Jacoji one on the right four millimeters. You see the Lynx Resale one is a bump bigger. And at this size, I noticed that the Lynx Resale has slightly gappier Miami Cuban links compared to the Jacoji one that has tighter links. Now, when you have tighter links, you got more kinks. So is it a bad thing? I don't think so. Both of them are pretty tight links. It's just the machine made ones, the Jacoji ones are as tight as possible that you could make a Miami Cuban link, but both look good overall. Also with the Jacoji ones, you're getting that Italian finish. You have a, a richer gold color compared to the Lynx resale that has the natural 14 karat gold color in which these are. So the two major differences between the two. Next we have the five moment. This is such a popular size. I got it on right now at 22 inches. Perfect for daily wear. And I want to mention before I forget, there is a slight difference for as far as the links go. The resale links, the domestic made have more of a flat filing on them or diamond cut. They're not hand filed obviously as they're machine made, but it doesn't have the rounded um, links like the Jacoji Miami Cuban links, more of a traditional style. So there is a slight difference. I honestly like both of them. I gravitate more towards the resale links because they're a little flatter and I feel like they just go against the skin easier and are more comfort to wear. That's why I like Jacoji curves over Miami Cuban links because I feel like they are more comfortable to wear overall and I'm a big comfort guy. So they both give off the shape and look of a traditional Miami Cuban link but slight variances. I know a lot of people are particular with Miami Cuban links, so I have to mention that there. So on the left, we have the domestic one. On the right, we have the Jacoji one. You could see the difference there. The links are both tight on them. Very nice and well-made chains. What I have to note with the domestic one is, for some reason, they use really small male ends for the locks, and I'll put it across the screen. I actually talked to the factory and said, these gotta change. We have to upgrade these locks. So the next batch that we receive, we should have locks that are a little bit bigger, but overall, they do click lock securely. It's just for this batch, they were slightly undersized. So I have to note that, but we are working to get the beefier male ends, so it's a nice, secure lock that everyone knows, because like I said, everyone is super picky about locks and Miami Cuban links in general. Next, we have my favorite size. Personally, if I was to go with one of these, it'd be the six millimeter. And look at those links go. I, it's always hard to kind of illustrate this straight hang test. Again, uh, people get our chains, our link chains, flackers, whatever, and they try to do it and say, hey, it doesn't hang perfectly straight. I never was on camera saying a chain should hang perfectly straight. I didn't make up the rules, nor do I live by them. But for a lot of people that love Miami Cuban links, like I said, for a machine made chain, this thing is perfect. And honestly, there's no such thing as a perfect chain, but it's near that. Here is the box lock. Has a little bit bigger tongue that matches it proportionally. Six millimeter. 
Perfect. So I like this chain this size the most. If I was to go with the Miami Cuban link, it would be this one right here. The seven millimeter is the next size up, but it's a bump too big. If I was just wanting a daily casual wear, six millimeter, 22 inch on the neck. I love this size overall. You'll see it side by side with the Jacoji one. Six millimeter is the bomb. Last but not least, the seven millimeter that we have currently. This is a nice heavy chain if you want to stand out just a little bit more. The prices are so good on these domestic Miami Cuban links. It's going to be tough for anyone to beat the prices that we're offering on links resale. And we could do that because, again, we're not paying as much taxes, duties, and labor for these chains. And also, links resale is targeted to buy and sell secondhand jewelry. That's what we want to grow it in. These are like when Costco sells the turkey for the chickens for really cheap to get you to buy it. We want to offer new stuff that is really competitive in pricing to get more volume and traffic there and ultimately want to grow both ends. But that is why they are there. And we're going to be offering a lot more new or how we call it on links resale, never been worn. That is basically new um, in our language on that website. So seven millimeter, 22 inch Miami Cuban link. This thing is so perfect. I just tuck it in and then there it is. It's a beautiful look overall. So again, to wrap this up, the domestic Miami Cuban links, they are, if they are never been worn and in that section, they are brand new chains um, and they're ready to ship. That is the benefit. I'm not saying these are better than the jewelers in Miami Cuban links hand making them. Those are really good and I know a lot of people gravitate towards that, rightfully so, but if you want a really nice chain and it's going to ship within one or two business days after you order it and get to you super quick, it's available and it is a good quality. Um, this might be an option for you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know down below if you like the new Miami Cuban links on linksresale.com. That's it for today's video. We'll see you on our next Julie video.